Okay, it's beer o'clock again on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Lindyman's and it's the bottle of their Apple Lambic coming in at 3.5% ABV. Uh, this one was kindly sent to me from Jens in Germany. Thank you very much, Jens, for sending me such a lovely sounding beer. Um, to my wife's discovery, she reviewed this first. I'll just show you the bottle cap in a moment. There you go. Belgian beer, this one. There we go. My wife discovered that it had a, a cork as well. So, become ready prepared to open this up. Excuse me. But an apple lambic, eh? How good? How good does that sound? There you go. Here's the cork. Here's the glass. Now again, it's lunchtime here in the UK. Look at that. It's lunch time, but we're still in the midst of this massive heat wave. Boiling hot, and it's 12 o'clock, it must be up in the late 20s already. So, time for a beer on a Sunday afternoon. It's a one finger white head, loads of carbonation, as you'd expect from a lambic. Um, colour is slightly hazy, kind of apple juice coloured beer if you like. Um, I'm going to get my nose into this one then. And superb, it's the, it's the nose of summer, it really is. Most definitely that kind of lovely funky sour lambic nose. But with the added twist of apple. So let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. It's a refreshing kind of sherbet bomb for lunchtime. It's a fruit sherbet bomb. When I'm saying sherbet, I mean the carbonation just explodes on your tongue with that funkiness, that sourness, and then the sweet apple. It's like a golden delicious they've used. Oh yes, lambics are so, so, so kind of summer beers, they, 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 it's an ideal, especially this one with the fruit added, it's, a, it's an ideal summer drink as opposed to a cider or a glass of champagne. Again, the reason why I say cider and champagne because you do get the hints me personally I always have done it's a split between a cider and a really nice champagne a lambic um, great great stuff great great stuff superb um, Lindemans again out in Belgium Got an almost minty finish there on the beer. It's going to be bottle conditioned. I want to show you the bits and pieces that get put in. It's the second fermentation process. It's the yeast that gets added to the beer to give it that lovely fizz. And it's just made the beer a little darker which is perfectly acceptable. 
I'm going to give you my final thoughts and a tasting on Lindemann's apple at 3.5% ABV. But I want to mention that 3.5% ABV first and that you could quite easily sup away at this all afternoon. And it wouldn't really affect you at 3.5. Such a wonderfully, wonderfully fruit. It's 25% fruit, which would probably be 25% apple. It's www.lindemans.be. Um, please check these guys out. If you like your Lambics, this apple Lambic from Lindemans, I am pretty sure you would love it. Um, rating. Fabulous, fabulous, fabulous beer. Easily a 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10 for me, the Real Ale Guide. Another massive thank you to Jens for sending me the beer over from Germany. Belgian beer from Germany. Really nice thing to do. Thank you very much for yeah, sending the beer. Put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to Real Ale Craft Beer. And cheers.